Hey, what's up, guys? It it's iKillers here, and today for this video, we're gonna be doing 100 overall Demar Derozan gameplay. We're gonna do a review on him to see how he actually plays in game, because some people don't really like his stats. They they mainly just have him for overall, but I've been curious on how he and Jimmy Butler play compared to their stats. So, as you see on the screen, we got very lucky. Now, you guys may be wondering, 11.9 mil, that's a lot of the co that's a lot of coins. And yes, it is. But when you take everything into account, this card is really rare right now. And one person in a Discord in the Amelia Lab Mobile official Discord server sold their strategic DeMar DeRozan for 33 million coins. One on one that dropped in my auction house got in, got bought really quick for 27 and a half million coins. We got them for 11.9 mil. So we're almost doubling our coins on this card. But there's not that many people who have reviewed this DeMar DeRozan yet. So I want to be I want to be one of those people to show you guys how good he actually plays and for people who have millions of coins I want to show them whether or not he's actually like he can actually be be relied on as a starter. So come over here. You see he's boosted up to a 102, 95 speed, 96 agility, 92 dribble speed, 98 dribbling, 97 first set, 96 strength, 95 quickness, 95 vert, 90 tip in. Going to the offensive side, 90, 94 dunking, 99 layup, 95 inside paint shot, and nine score on contact, they gypped him. 96 mid-range, 87 three-pointer, 92 contested shot, 98 shooting touch, 98, 90 shot off dribble. And then you see right here, his defense, 97, 97 on ball, 92 block, 91 steal, 96 hands on, hands on perimeter, 91 interception. You get the gist. He's he's a pretty well-rounded well guard. Now, people see that 87 three-pointer and they're like oh well he oh he can't he can't shoot that well he's not a great shooter and they might be right that's what that's what we're trying to find out though so let's let's happen to a game let's happen to a game actually actually no hang on let me take him out of this line. I want to put him in with uh, Westbrook and Harden. Yeah, let me, let me put him in this lineup. So you see right there in that lineup is Westbrook, James Harden, uh, DeRozan, or was George Gervin. Uh, Kevin Love, Hakeem Olajuwon. That George Gervin, guys. That George Gervin is awesome. I just want to say that. That George Gervin is awesome. So if anybody is planning on getting him, trust me, you will not you will not regret it. I might actually make a review on him just to show uh, how good how good that card is because he's just amazing. Bro, one hundred and seven though. Really? See, guys, this is why I don't do. Rev <laughs> this is why I don't don't like showdown. Like, why the hell am I going against a one hundred and seven? Anyway, but you know what? We can't complain. It's just what you expect. Let's see. Let's see how good he he can do. And, yep, yep, that, guys, don't expect me to win this, okay? 
Damar. How? Now, how'd you miss a dunk? <laughs> Yo, do you guys see how nobody went for the ball? Uh, that it's so funny whenever that happens. Like everybody just stood there and they were like, "Nah, I'm not gonna get. I'm not gonna go for the ball." <sighs> I think everybody wishes that EA would fix uh, showdown matchmaking. Uh, DeRozan, not a perfect release, but he makes the three. That's a good sign. That is a good sign. Westbrook with the steal. Harden. DeRozan. Back to back, though? Back to back, though? Over the defense. Guys, this is what I'm talking about. Now you saw in the you saw when I originally went over the stats, I had plus four three. I had plus four shooting stats. And while you could say that oh maybe he doesn't meet those Oh that crossover. Ah oh, dang it. Danny Green, why'd you have to get why'd you have to interfere with DeRozan? Why? Now you guys can make the argument that maybe he doesn't make he doesn't make as many threes with Without the shooting boost. But another contact shot. Bruh. Yeah, this one. Yeah, this quarter is not like a that great of a representation, okay? Alright, let's not lose the quarter, okay? Let's at least not lose. Throws in three. Three in a row. He only has a 91 three-pointer with the boost. So it's not like he has a we have like a crazy shooting boost. I don't want to. I don't want to just shoot threes because that's boring. Yeah, yeah. A one going against a one hundred seven is just a death sentence. And then nobody plays defense. These. This is why. This is why I don't understand. Like, why is nobody playing defense? Four, four straight though. Four straight three pointers with only a ninety one. Okay, so where do we go? 14 to 17? I know, guys. I know. I lost a quarter. You suck. But, guys, I won against 107. That's not... That's not on me. That's on... That's on the matchmaking. Okay? I got unlucky. So, let's see if any, any draws has popped up. Nope. It, and look. June Butler goes for 13.5. So... Ray, Ray Allen actually tanked a lot. A 102? You kidding me, bro? Alright, it's more manageable, I guess. We'll do three quarters just to see if we can maybe get a fair matchup. Relatively fair. So, in another news, um... I've... I noticed that my last two live streams that I did were not uploaded. Another contact shot. What the hell is this? And I don't know why they weren't uploaded. Cause when I when I was streaming with Omelet Arcade, um There you go, DeRozan. I had it set to where it was on my YouTube account. You, there was probably like one or two people in there who were watching from on YouTube. So I don't understand why it, why they didn't upload. I tried Google searching it, and it's like, oh, well, like Google did not give me anything. Oh, look at that block. Who who blocked that? Oh wait, DeRozan has the ball. I'm dumb. <laughs> so, so I don't know if that's just a, like a bug. I don't know if that's a 
that's a bug on the app's part or or anything of that nature, but it's like I don't know. Like not nothing surprises me these days. Cause you you always expect at least one thing to mess up in some way, shape, or form. No no matter how annoying it is, you you just always assume that, hey, like something's gotta mess up. There's no way things can run flawlessly, and they can't. But but sometimes those mess ups are a bit too frequent than our liking. I hate when I hate when you, my guy is setting off. Anybody else hate that? Oh, LeBron? For th- he has not missed a three pointer. He has not missed a three pointer. Guys. This is what I'm talking about. The, this card is so nice. Oh, oh wow, we got blocked. Who was that, Shaq? Try again? Oh, okay, he finally missed. Oh, step back. Mid range? That's cash. So, yo. This DeMar DeRozan is really nice, man. Obviously, I wouldn't say pick him up. Yeah, I was going to lose regardless of what happened. Like, I wouldn't say pick him up at the price he's going at right now. But, if his price drops low enough, this card is really good. He... He is really good. Um, let's try one more. Let's try one more game. Like, I, I probably don't even need to show you guys much more. Like, okay, 96. So, <laughs> we beat a 102. That's fun. It's always satisfying when you beat those guys who are using the multi year. All right, so for this last one, he's gonna be going against ninety six Jason Tatum. So this will be interesting. But like, guys, this is why you d- you shouldn't always judge cards off their normal stats and only off their stats. Because some cards play so much better than what their stats say that you. It could leave you shocked. Like, like it's reasonable for people to have their doubts about this about this DeRozan card. Okay, you miss again. Yeah, like I said, no card will ever go perfect. Actually, no, I didn't say that, but not now I said it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Willie. Okay, Willie Hernan Gomez. Yo, this card is so agile. Holy crap. He blows by everybody if you if you give him a couple dribble moves. He just blows by everyone. Mid range. The thing the thing about shooting mid ranges in this game is that you get a fair amount of space every time. Cause they're always trying to stay back to prevent like you from driving to the lane. What, what kind of foolishness? I don't. I don't like the AI layup animations. Okay, I'll just say that. I don't even need to do that crossover because he was froze. But still, you give him like a couple moves to the rim, and it's just right. Why say a couple moves to the rim? You give them a couple moves, and then go to the rim. They can't do much about it. It's that. He's actually kind of crazy. Catch and shoot three pointer. There we go. So what is he having all? Like, let's see, we dropped fourteen the first game. He has he has thirty nine points in three quarters. Not the not the most uh, scoring type guard, but you see, he's making plus eights, plus ten three pointers. 
that normally cards with a lower end three point rating. I'm not gonna say like 87 is low, because 87, 91 three point rating, like that's it's not low, but considering what the cards overall is, it's kind of low. And he's made all but two three pointers. Or if you want, if you want to count a block shot as a miss, then all but three three pointers. But still, get a gamble of. Oh, dang it, it went out of bounds. I feel like those, those type of saves don't nearly go out of bounds as often this season as they would in previous seasons. Anybody else feel like that? Feel like that's the case. Over over Tatum? <laughs> oh my god, this this card's so much fun. Nineteen points against a ninety six. Nineteen. That's a so he dropped forty six points in three quarters. I don't think I have to say much else, guys. This card is amazing. This card, he's so good, honestly. If he wasn't going for so much, this card would be like he he's not worth the twenty five mil that he's probably going for right now. But this card is so nice. Okay, I've said that like five times. I cannot emphasize. Properly. Like anything I say cannot do this card justice. Okay. So. I'm going to leave it at that. This card's good. If you want. If you're going with the light pass room. He's definitely worth it. Okay. He's definitely worth the time. The grind. I'm going to sell him. Before his price completely falls off a cliff. But I really enjoyed this card. I hope you I hope you guys were able to get a good grasp at the gameplay. And I don't know, man. I don't know, I'm I'm tempted to keep him. I'm honestly super tempted to keep him, but I know it's not the smart decision. So um like and subscribe if you want. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys with in a day or two. I don't know. Peace out.